Oh, I didn't realize it was a video. Oh, how sweet. Like a, okay. Go into sleep mode soon so you can see yourself. So at this point, you have a sixth grade and a seventh grade and a kindergarten. So today we have a K, okay. a five, and a six. And I'm sorry, what did I say? Six and seven. I said five, five and six. Yeah. So uh, K, year. five, and six because. Okay. So next year we add, will be K one and five, so six, seven. So the 9, 10 year will be K one, five, six, and seven. Right. Okay. And the K one will be on the first floor, mm -hmm. and the junior or the middle school will be on the second floor. Okay. And what is your uh, ratio of teachers to class size? Um, the changes I'm sure between the, t the two grades. So our, I think our class sizes are pretty similar. Um, our class size is 20 to 23, depending on mm -hmm. the needs of the class. So it's like 1 to 20 to 23. And then, okay. I guess if you technically include the other teachers we have, the, the special ed teachers, the intervention teachers. So how many do you have? You have special ed teachers? We have two special ed teachers. Mm -hmm. uh, intervention two, specialists? Yeah, two, two special ed slash intervention teachers, mm -hmm. um, eight content teachers, and... I guess technically two enrichment teachers. Two mm -hmm. enrichment teachers. Yeah. All, all full time. All full time. Okay. Um, any paraprofessionals? Any classroom assistants? Not for the middle school. Light for you. We have two teachers. Two teachers in every room. Right. That so we sense. have eight so teachers for ninety-five kids. Um, we also have a special education coordinator. We also have. We share those elective people as well. Um, we also both on the student support side have a social worker <coughs> um, and a school nurse. On site? Yep. Okay. Librarian? Anybody who, or does everybody sort of take care of the library? Li that libraries for us are in the classroom so that we and teachers take care of them. Okay, so mm -hmm. that one room that we put together with all the books is just this resource room? Right. They were. They were Organized and then the teachers went and pulled from those okay. and to make their own lives. So the, the um, libraries are in the classroom. Okay. Yeah, we have. I know that's typical of the KIPP, I think, philosophy, isn't it? Or is that yeah, most of the schools have it. But it typically, that's based on space. I think for us, it, it's really empowering for teachers to be able to have their own mm -hmm. set right there mm -hmm. and, and mm -hmm. be very hands on with kids. And it offers the kids a great opportunity just be exposed to a lot of different levels of texts mm -hmm. and have something on that level so mm -hmm. you can do your work as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it works for us because the kids are constantly switching books, especially the lower levels. They're just reading four or five books a week. Mm -hmm. You have to go to the library and get four books or go four days a week to get books just as you can do this. So to have mm -hmm. it in the classroom for its five minutes. Accessibility is really yeah. what, you know, what's important here. Do you have a did you develop a tech lab for the middle school kids? Because I know we didn't do, we weren't really involved with your your organization of the middle school this summer. We were mostly concentrating on the kindergarten. <coughs> Did you put together a technology lab, or, or, or is everything in the classroom, or are you still working on technology? Um, so the implementation, <laughs> Three questions, I guess. <laughs> the implementation of the technology was a little behind schedule from the RSD. Okay. Um, the construction, just a month ago, they finished wiring the building. Um, really? And so we've been operating thinly on construction. We just got a new math lab mm -hmm. that just got put together right there. That Wait. Just got put together yesterday. Um, wow. So that will start to be used okay. um, for the middle schoolers, but I think we're going to be focusing on mobile parks instead of. So there's enough laptops for each. Your, fo your intent is to have enough laptops for each of the middle schoolers at some the point? The intent is to have enough laptops teachers to be free to okay. use technology as they okay. use it. Did you get smart boards at all in your... We have active boards in all the rooms. Everyone, even the... No, I didn't think so. Okay, I know we put up the whiteboard right there. We actually operate technology free. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not that's, really. You have a, a tele cell phone? Yeah. <laughs> well, we, uh, well, we, we know, I know what you're talking about. We have some growth areas. We, mm -hmm. we we don't have any yeah. computers in the classrooms, no okay. technology in the classrooms, okay. and we do not have a active board. We were looking at it to add mm -hmm. it for next year, trying to move some things around. The staffing takes up so much of the budget mm -hmm. that it's such a critical component. 
Mm -hmm. We hate to sacrifice technology. Of course. Mm -hmm. In the 21st century, but um, it is one place where, unfortunately, we haven't had access to what we thought we would have access to because of disruption. Right, right, right. Your infrastructure is still being worked on. Yeah, right. the scenes of that. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Should I not say that? No, it's okay. okay.